and we are carrying on with Saat Kun Ma. This is part two of our reaction. So if you haven't seen part one yet, please go back and watch that and come back and watch this. Let's jump into part two. Here we go. Oh. Oh. She's wearing all black again. I was wondering, I was like, are we going to get a death nail this time or what's going to happen? Not about money. Whoa. Ugh, he goes hard. Yeah, I don't. Mm -mm. Uh oh. They're digging the oh. grave. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh, in the Heck snowy yeah. ground as well. Heck yeah. Her crew got her. <laughs> Anybody who were to wander along, they'd be like, okay, yeah, they'd be like, lost what's going it. on? Okay, but how's he gonna die? She's just gonna push him in the hole? <laughs> <laughs> Hi there, hello. Peekaboo. This is real odd. Oh, the cat. On top of the grave. Is he John Gulli? Papa Sajati. Chord de Tune. Yeah, but she's rich. Miss Sahi, but for my school pedal jag. दो रास्ते थे पहुंचने के फिर जाने कहां उस रास्ते पे एक कुत्ता थोड़ा पागल बड़े साहब की छोटी पिस्तौल बस्ते में छुपाई और रास्ता नहीं बदला करती कुत्तों का भेजा उड़ा देती है ओ कुकु दे शर आर सपोर्टिंग हर Oh, uh, the next is gonna be a jockey or something. To present the trophy, may I now call on stage Mr. Nikolai Vronsky, science attaché to the Russian Council. Sir! Oh. oh, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here to hand over this wonderful trophy to the winner. I did bet on this particular horse and I won a fortune. Thank you for that information. <laughs> I'm Vronsky. Nikolai Vronsky. Then I must be Anna. Anna. She's, She's like Anna a new Anna. identity with every single one. Mm -hmm. Can I at least drop you? Apke Nivastak? Please. Mere paas. Kari hai. It's destiny. <laughs> what? Is it? Oh, oh my gosh. He's so upset. Oh. <laughs> uh oh, vodka. No English, no Campa Cola, only Russian. Kis kushi me? Ki tum Russia ja rahe ho? Oh. Petersburg Medical Academy me padne nastrovia. Kyu? Kyu? Nick loves me, and I love you, my little sugar. Mm. You're sending him some crazy <laughs> mixed signals, lady. <laughs> I don't think that's fair. I think that we're going to take two weeks. What'd you say? KGB. It didn't translate for us. <laughs> What'd you say? What if he married her for her money <laughs> and he's not really rich? Oh. I'll <laughs> my Yeah, something sus about this yeah. guy. Yeah, and he has like a family or something back home. Mm. Yeah, we want to know. Moscow now. Hey, colleague. This is why you start learning Russian in secret. <laughs> <laughs> Tumhari last 
वर्ड्स का मतलब था डार्लिंग oh. मैं <gasps> जल्दी वापस आ रहा यू डर्टी डॉग तुम मुझसे कुछ छुपा रहे हो निक नो Because even earlier he said, um, "Let me take you back to your mansion." Yeah, he didn't say house or home or something. He said mansion. I thought that maybe he just translated it. Yeah, weird, but I don't know. I but feel maybe, like yeah. yeah. Don't come back with money. Nahi jata. Main kudan kolam jata hu. Kudan kolam nuclear power project. It means that your country soon to become one of the self-sufficient nuclear states. तुम जासूस हो Our spies, our Russians always spies. <laughs> KGB, <laughs> all of you. <ya. laughs> of course, that's he's gonna say no. Every time I've asked my dad that, he says no. <laughs> no, not at all. India का nuclear test successful हुआ. दो बॉम्ब फेंके साहेब में एक साथ. पहला शादी का और दूसरा मुझे रूस रवाना कर दिया। कॉलेज में एक सेमिनार ट्रिप पर मैं मॉस्को गया था वहाँ जो नजारा मैंने देखा रॉन्सकी के पास एक नहीं दो दो आना थी yep, I figured he had a whole family yeah. and he needed money for them. मैं आज तक खुद को उसकी मौत का जिम्मेदार मानता oh. हूँ Because he told her. Mm-hmm. Yep. But I mean, I mean, just get a divorce. Don't need to necessarily take him out. I mean, he has two kids. That's why I'm like Prina. <laughs> Shahid Major Sahab, first husband. Oh my God. Chup sare bunge. This is very strange yeah, now. Yeah. He's saying that we took a maru major back seat. मेरे I'm asking you who gave it to you. It's part of my job. It's a part of my job to understand. What? What to marry her? I'm husband and wife. Key acting. Got a hint. Wow. Okay. What if that's really true? I'm so scared of them right now. They're yeah. so creepy. Oh shit. I don't think he knows that they're down there. No. I got the job, honey. And I'll be back for you. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Dang. Got bit Ooh, everywhere. There was one on him as well. Yeah. Kaisi hai? Madam. Oh, Inspector Kimatlal. Mm-hmm. Officer Kimatlal. Oh. Intelligence Bureau. Got a promotion. But this time, one thing is missing from your husband's belongings. The file. Ah, oh, if it gets found, then my hands are a little bit. Trust me. बस अब आप मुझ पर वैसे शाम को मसरूफ होंगे यू नॉट आस्किंग हर आउट ऑन अ डेट आज थोड़ी ज्यादा होगा कोई बात नहीं अभी मेहनत भी तो ज्यादा करनी है आपको व्हाट ऑफिस में ओह ओके आई वाज लाइक व्हाट इन द बेडरूम स्टॉप दैट Why are we drinking Jaeger? Why is it she sending him to the the snake pit at night after drinking? Yeah. Toh par barish mein seediyon pe pisalan hogi. 
It's muscle me. <clears throat> you look so different now too. She yeah. switched up her look again. No, I really enjoy what they're doing with like wardrobe and makeup. Each identity is a different person. Chori. Hmm? <sighs> <laughs> okay. I feel like that's the only way she knows how to like relate to men is to use her like sexuality. Okay, sir, please. Okay. That's nice. <laughs> okay, yeah, you can go now. Oh, Delhi, but apna dil sahib ke paas chhod. Oh. Bar bar wapas lene ki niyat se aata tha, par har bar phir wahi bhul jata. Chaliye, madam. Anna Karenina. That's a hmm. Russian. Story. Yeah. So what? No. What medication is that? Yeah, what, what's it? Oh, yeah, the blue pill. That's what I thought it was. <laughs> so I can marry you. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, what gave you that idea? <laughs> She's got a superpower. All the days of my life till death do us apart. I, Susanna Anna Marie Johannes, take you, Kimatlal, to be my husband. She's trying to change her voice, too. She's doing an yeah. amazing job. Like She's it's... completely changed with. And honor you in all the days of my life till death do us part. Mm hmm. Till death do you part. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she takes that very yeah, seriously. Yeah, she's like, well, there's no other option. Sounds like you have to go. She's like, a divorce? Don't know her. Yeah. <laughs> Are we already to the. Is he dead? Already, I think he is. Yep. <gasps> yep. She was quick on that one. Yeah. Very quick. Wow. Quick work. Was it the pills? Oh, yeah. Probably a heart attack from taking too many. Viagra bottle me poison tha? Viagra bottle me Viagra. He took too many. Mm -hmm. Photos? Leading to a massive heart attack. Yep, same heart attack. Kuch saal baad, I Russia se ek doctor ban ke wapas aaya. Oh my God, what is he? Par tab tak, sahib ek mareez ban chuki thi. Man, what do you mean? Um, ne saalo baad dekh rahe ho mujhe. Uh, when you were less deranged. Kuch patli? Say no. That's the only correct answer. That is an even better answer. This is your chance, bro. Okay, so yep. Uh oh. Uh Whoa! Whoa! Certainly. <laughs> yeah, not like this. Mere or Sahib ke beech ka jo weird hamesha ke liye toot chuka tha wo raat hamare rishte ki aakhri raat thi and that was in her things yeah. they found so hmm. yeah gunga chacha ko lekar main sahib ka saath hamesha hamesha ke liye chhod aaya oh wow hijack drama i wonder how that's going to play into it if at all facial superimpositions as well as the pcr tests clearly indicate that She's dead. Do we believe him? No. <laughs> yeah. I don't think she is. No. Now I don't. Yeah. After all the craziness. Damn, that must be like so weird to come back to the house you grew up in and it's just a carcass of what it was. Oh, okay. go to the Pondicherry house. We've never been. Hello? Uh, 
Yes, can I speak to Mr. Arun Kumar, please? No, he is not there. <laughs> It'll be fine. I have a friend in Vodafone. Abhi, abhi pata chal jayega. Usne last phone kahan se aur kaun se share se kiya? Or just hack his phone. <laughs> Mama, it's Daddy. I told him that you're very different. Oh, just <laughs> I told him you're very angry. Hi, Nandini. How are you? Where the fuck are you? Where the kids are? Just casual. Yeah. Arun. आपका कर्ज चुका दिया ऐसा है फिर एक दिन तुम्हारी शादी की खबर आई अब इससे अच्छी वजह मुझे और क्या मिलती खुदकुशी के लिए सब गाड़ी फोन कुछ भी खाने कर वो घर में भी सब मर जाएगी साहब खुला खेले साहब खुला खेले साहब न्यू हस्बैंड बिकॉज़ वी नेवर मेट द सिक्स्थ वन अपनी तरफ से तो मैं मर चुकी थी मगर जब आंख खुली तो कुछ अजीब सा लगा खुदा की नाक पे नजर का चश्मा हाँ तरफदार डॉक्टर मधुसूदन तरफदार इसका नाम है जेकुलटर्न थोड़ा खाओ तो दवाई और ज्यादा खाओ तो विष <laughs> जिसने कम में जिन्हा सीख लिया उसे कभी कमी नहीं होता सूप में कितना डालूं कम कि ज्यादा <laughs> मगर मोदूता ने प्रॉमिस किया कि अब वो कोलकाता वापस नहीं जाएंगे कभी भी मैं शादी के हक में नहीं थी yep. मगर मोदूता मुझे अपनी जायदाद का वारिस बनाना चाहते थे oh. कि कहीं उन्हें मुझसे पहले कुछ हो गया तो उनकी पहली बीवी और उसकी नालायक oh, wow. बेटी मेरी जिंदगी हराम कर देंगे Nothing sexier than a mushroom. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Come back fast. Bye bye. Han bhai, light ko kya hua? Oh god. This is when it sucks living alone. Although she doesn't live alone, but like, oh no, who's What? that? Go away. Oh, no. No. Oh my god. <laughs> Poor uncle. It's also this is when it sucks to be a man. <laughs> be like you, you go deal there? with the robber. Nikrishnan shahid ho gaye. Trident over I or Nariman house pe. Oh. Shop theek ho jaye. Come come. Modda? Oh. Uta. Thank you. Nice. <gasps> what 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 he has like a he's got scratches that weren't scar. there before what i thought i, I saw a scar yeah. lies she thinks he attacked her but like why would he do that your favorite mushroom belute suddenly i don't like mushrooms very much anymore Watch him eat. Oh my god. Stop. Who? <laughs> Somebody ate some of the soup. Oh no, uncle died. some of the soup how can you think such a thing matha kharab ho gaya tumhara ha i saved your life so sanna ek what are you doing 
Oh. Oh, the beginning scene, yes. right? Yep. Please, Shono, please listen to me. Yeah. Yeah, she's definitely gone like off the deep end at this point. For mighty body. Susanna, I I needed the money. You could have asked for it. I went bloody bankrupt, Susanna. I do this. <laughs> if I were him, I think I might be trying to leave right yeah, now. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, get up and leave. This is I, I, I really loved her. You loved her? Ah, yeah. <laughs> Dang. Yeah. Oh, okay, I was like, for okay. a second I was like, did he... Like, she lift her and her... No, she's gonna go in to try to save, I think. Yeah. Oh, my Jesus! Oh, bless you, auntie. I don't think that's gonna... Yeah, one bucket is not gonna help. Oh, no, auntie. She's sacrificing herself, pretty much. <gasps> Damn. Oh, look what you did. I was in my eyes. I was in my eyes. जिसे तैरना आता हो, उसे डूब कर आत्महत्या करने की कोशिश नहीं करनी चाहिए। Oh, that's a good line. और फिर मुझे पता चला कि मैं तो मर चुकी हूँ। Yeah, that's so messed up. आपने छह लोगों को वक्त से पहले सीधा ऊपर। मेरी वो जरूरत शायद हमेशा तुमसे पूरी होती रहे। and you tried to sleep That's with him. him. That's what I'm saying. I'm going to get a little bit of 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 a scary, 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 a little bit of 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 a <laughs> Why? He's dead. Or is he and gonna this kill her? Time, I'm going to drink his blood. <laughs> what do you mean he's dead already? What what do you mean? Oh she's becoming a nun. <sighs> She's marrying God. She's marrying Jesus. And he already died. Yeah. So he's already dead. Okay. Mere khuda, Yeshu Masi se kaam hai, jo mujko sabse pyaar hai. Main, Sister Anna. Now she's Sister Anna. Okay. Huh. All righty. What the heck? <laughs> oh. Oh God, you are not ready. <laughs> My seven sins. Wow. That was pretty good. I like this movie a lot. Is it twisted? Yes. Yeah. But I enjoyed the crap out of it. I just thought it was so well done. Ooh, we got extra. Is that the wife, right? Yeah, That's the, the wife. wife. The wife. Oh no. Did he just never come back? <laughs> I'm so scared. Oh, okay. Okay. Whew. No, I'm scared. Oh, oh my god. <gasps> She's dead. <laughs> Forever. If this ever was an advertisement for how crazy women can get. <laughs> I would say <laughs> yes. <laughs> Don't scorn a woman. <laughs> no, absolutely uh, do not. Wow. My what goodness. a movie. That was really good, though. It was so well yeah. done. I 
like I'm I'm yeah, floored. I'm, I'm um because they said it was based off a book, and then they kept referencing the Seven Wives of Bluebeard. I'm curious now, like how that book goes, just to see like in in the story how they keep referencing that. Like, did she read it and get inspired by it? Like, what? You know? My knowledge of Bluebeard mm-hmm. is like rudimentary at best. <laughs> I haven't actually yeah. read the source material, but from what I know about it, is like it's quite sick and twisted. Okay, because I'm yeah. just curious, like if she drew inspiration after reading it for like the final one from the very beginning she was crazy well, <laughs> she's got worse and worse as time went on it's just so, i feel yeah. like you could watch this movie multiple times and like really break it down mm-hmm. and like figure out thematically what it's all about because i think it is so much deeper than what it is on the surface because like surface level it's like oh she's a lady who like just kept falling in love and kept marrying guys the the wrong guys the wrong guys by love yeah and then and then you know in the end she decides to marry jesus and like be absolved (laughs) of all her sins frustrating (laughs) like no because like he defended her to the very end and I'm like no but like I want to see justice in that sense but like obviously she got away with everything yeah so. she got away with everything and I but I thought that the way they did it was mm-hmm. actually really interesting because like I had seen the trailer for this a little while back and I thought it was a, a very interesting concept of like oh a woman gets married seven times but it could mm-hmm. potentially be you know a little bit goofy but <laughs> <laughs> it, it it wasn't. It was done in such a good way because at least in the beginning, actually, I think yeah. for all of them, mm-hmm. they were all kind of awful to her. Yes. Yeah. That is one thing that you see throughout is like, even though they're such different men and they're from such different backgrounds and everything, every single one is is not good yeah so so in that way like we we were already rooting for her like Mm -hmm. we were okay with what she did yeah at the very beginning i was like okay yeah and then like she slowly (laughs) just started descending into madness and then like and then we find out like i was saying like about the dog at the very beginning like that really shows who you are as a person if that's like as a child that was her instinct to do and so then i'm like oh wait now i've seen her in a different light because i thought maybe the first guy is what started her thing but if she already had this mindset before that then i don't know you know yeah no it definitely gives you a lot to think about and like you know what you were saying about it being a story right like a Mm -hmm. like literature yeah i think that when you kind of adapt books, novels, stories, whatever. A lot of the time there's so much more nuance Mm -hmm. um, in the in the books. And so, you know, you can really see all of the the different layers to the story and to the character because, you know, like we remarked, she's like an entirely different identity. That's one thing I loved that she did is that she reinvented herself every time and is like like I, she did kind of like go more towards whatever guy she was dating, kind of change her personality to fit that. But like, I think that's just an interesting thing because she's like, maybe if I completely change, yeah, I'll, it will work this time. If I completely change, and she just does that rather than I don't know, be herself. So we don't really know who she exactly. is. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And that's what I find so interesting and frustrating at the same time because even to the very end, when she just decides to change and become like Sister Anna, it's like. Okay, but like, who are you? Who are you? Yep. At this point, like, we we don't really know. Maybe the person who she is is the little girl who shot the dog. Yeah. And maybe that's who she is. And everyone else is just like, maybe just like a different veneer yeah. of her, but like not really mm-hmm. who she is. And then her, her I would say her, her family, they're just as wild as she was. Her like uncle, her auntie, everybody like, they're just like, yeah. Whatever you need, we got you. Ride Don't, or die. Yeah, exactly. Like, <laughs> oh, dig a grave out back? Sure, we're on it. You you come out here when you're ready. Like, that's wild, too, because that means, like, you have to be a certain type of person to be able to do that. And that's how much they loved her, that they're like, yeah, we'll do it for you. So, I don't know. That's very interesting. Yeah, no, it's super interesting. And, like, I guess especially watching it today, like, 
I forget when this movie came out. I think it's like 2011. Yeah, whatever it is. Like, it's not it's not a recent movie. Yeah, 2011. And so I feel like in today's rhetoric, there's a lot, especially for women, there's a lot of like, you know, you got to know yourself, you know, (laughs) you got to like (laughs) love yourself first, sister, before you can love someone else and get out there and all of that. And I think this is actually a very interesting investigation Mm -hmm. into that, you know, because she was always looking for love outside of herself and and, then would mold to that yeah and she never gave herself the opportunity to just like be by herself Mm -hmm. and it's not like she had to marry any of these men to be financially yeah. stable. See, at first, that's why I first had thought when, because her pa- father passed away and she immediately got married. And I was like, oh, maybe she couldn't get the money until she got married. But then it wasn't that. Because then as we kept going, it was, there was no issues whatsoever no. about it. So I was like, oh, she just needed to fill that gap in her life. And so she just was like, I'm instantly going to throw this guy at it. And hopefully it. I was under the impression that the first guy was maybe chosen for her by her dad. Okay. But then like everyone else, yeah. Yeah. She was literally <laughs> just like, let me fill this hole in my heart with like a yeah. dude. And, and none like, of them were good choices. Like, none of them. Uh, like uh, the one guy though, I just like, I, I the Russian guy, I feel bad just in the sense of if those were his children. Yeah. That's the only reason because like those children don't know what happened necessarily to their father or like when they do find out like they're like I mean that's like a hard thing to understand like your father got bit by snakes in In India yeah with his other wife like that is something you're like what so I don't know that's the only thing that like I'm like oh man I I don't know I feel like she could have really just like messed him up and left like made him leave but or of like, course it's her, so yeah, she had exactly. to take him out. There probably was another solution, like get the marriage yeah. annulled or something. It's like he's married to someone else, so clearly yeah. this marriage is not binding. But no, we resorted to murder. Uh, um, and then that, that the cop one, that one threw me through a loop, though. I did not see her actually marrying the cop. I was like, okay, she's just using him right now, so I was yeah. in trouble. I was like, oh, okay, well, why are we still going with this guy? Oh, okay, we're getting married to this guy. <laughs> Very yeah. quickly got rid of him, but still, like, it was just like, oh, okay. Interesting yeah. man. Okay. Really, it was just, like, <laughs> wild, this journey. But I think it was just overall so well done with, like, the creative cinematography. Mm-hmm. The music, I thought, yeah. was really great was as well. Really and I saw in the credits, like, the director of the film did the music. Oh, cool. Um, and it was just, like, so nicely done. And, of course, Priyanka Chopra's acting in this was so good it was like such a great showcase yeah. of her acting skill and like for you this being the very first yeah. thing that you've ever seen of her yeah i just know her because of the jonas brothers but i knew she was bollywood royalty so i was like okay yeah i just never seen one with her I, so. this this was incredible i think this might be my favorite okay. performance of hers that i've seen to she date. did a great job i mean especially not only like did you have to play this type of character who changes so much but like over time as well so yeah. aging up all that and change your like just the way you move and everything as well so yeah because really cool. I, I thought that she did that so well because it was just like the little nuances in her acting like uh her voice mm-hmm. speaking a little bit slower a little deeper as she aged i didn't even know as well at one point i was like huh i wonder if a costume like wardrobe gave her yes. extra layers or something to just like look mm-hmm. a little bit mm-hmm. i think you know, so yeah when she was like age. had the glasses like right in the middle with the like the blue outfit she, yeah she looked bigger and i was like oh okay now yeah now she looks a lot older than she did before and yeah it's interesting how they did that yeah they they did a really great job although in the beginning i will say like i did notice the makeup on her mm-hmm. and on arun and i was kind of like oh why are they aging them up i mean i I thought yes. this in my head. At the I very didn't... first shot, right? Yeah. I thought the same thing. So like, at the very what? first shot, yeah. It looks really weird. Like her skin just looks really textured, mm-hmm. but like not natural. But then like, I think the performance has really sold it for me because mm-hmm. even though the makeup wasn't 100%, the underlying performances were really yeah. strong. So yeah. I was like, she's she's killing it. Yeah, <laughs> literally. <laughs> literally <laughs> and figuratively. But yeah, they, and she was great. And it was just really interesting as well just to see the level of talent attached to this too because, you know, we had some really 
well-known and well-respected actors of playing the the various husbands you know like we had like Nasruddin Shah at the end there Irfan Khan was in there as well am I crazy I thought it was John Abraham her second husband but he he wasn't looking quite as buff as I'm used to seeing him so <laughs> I'm like wait Maybe hold on too. is that him or is that just someone that looks oh, like him a bunch so of words too. it was John Abraham you are correct I'm like dang he looks so different different to me like he looked yeah because I, I was having one of those moments where I was like do I say his name out loud and potentially be like Achara you're wrong but then no I was right but yeah like all of the actors were just so so good and it's just interesting that some really well respected actors like Irfan Khan and uh, Nasruddin Shah joined the cast which to me shows that they thought that the script was really interesting mm -hmm. and especially for Irfan Khan, I mean, I have so much respect for him and his craft, and obviously it's very sad that he's no longer with us. I thought that he played that character of the third husband so well because he he really showed us the, the flip side of that person, you know, where on the one hand he's like, that romantic guy. Who's yeah, like, you were like, oh, yeah. So, and then literally two seconds later, we're like, oh wait, never mind. It Let's turn dark that very quickly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. and he like really leaned into it too. Mm -hmm. Like he wasn't scared to go there, go from being that like super poetic romantic guy to like truly scary, awful yeah. third husband. Yeah, beat you. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Yeah. You're not into it. <laughs> but yeah, th this was this was such an interesting movie and like so different from a lot of things that we've seen, I think, from India. So like, yeah. amazing. Really liked it. Yeah. yeah. Well done. <laughs> Bravo, everyone involved. Anyway, you guys, let us know your thoughts in the comments below. What do you think this movie is about? Like, what is the theme? What are they, like, <laughs> trying to tell us about women, about relationships? Be, be careful. <laughs> yeah. Be afraid. Be very afraid because your wife is plotting to kill you. And she's thought about it at least once, okay? So, um, yeah, let us know your thoughts. And I hope you enjoyed this. We'll catch you next time. I'm Achara Kirk. This is Haley C. Ciao.